Good morning guys. It is Sunday morning and I'm really tired. <laughs> you can hear it in my voice. I haven't really woken up yet. I was supposed to go up at 9. Um, I came up at like 5 to 10 I think. I fell asleep a couple of times. I was tired, okay? Happens sometimes. Quite often actually for me. But yeah. Um, sorry for the super super short vlog yesterday it's it was just one of those days yeah i'm having a kitty that is playing in the room in there or in, in the closet i opened up a little space for him to lay and i'm just trying to figure out how to do that <laughs> yeah um good morning guys i am going to see if i can get some vlogs edited uh, drink my coffee and then I might make some cards. We'll see. My finger is itching so much. And if I don't have painkillers in me, it actually stings still. Um, the painkillers do work really, really good on this kind of pain. It kind of, kind of shows me um, how the painkillers doesn't really work on my migraine as they should. Um, mostly because they're not really supposed to, they're not made for that kind of pain. Um, I do get some relief from them, but um, this shows me that it's this kind of pain that they're really meant for. So hopefully one day here I will be off all my painkillers. Yeah. Good morning guys. I hope you have an awesome day. Well guys. It is time for me to head to bed. I actually took my camera with me to the shop, but it was full of people. Again, it seems like we're just going when there it's full of people. Hmm? Hmm? So, um, we went shopping for food. It went a little bit faster than I usually do. And we got a lot less things than we usually do. Uh, one thing is that we uh, eat a lot of frozen, like chicken and meat and stuff so we thought we should kind of try to clean out the fridge now and again so we have to do that with our chicken and everything um then also uh, i am going to try to uh, drink less milk i tried today gosh I, I took like this um coconut milk which seemed to be when this co or the coconut milk is basically no coconut proteins so don't seem to get allergies from it but um, a big part of my coffee is the milk that is one thing I discovered a huge part of my coffee is the milk so if I'm going to go off coffee uh, or go off milk I'm gonna need to go off coffee um, I probably need to get off dairy products but I'm kind of cleaning out the fridge by eating it because I don't want to throw out liters of yogurt instead I'm going to eat them yum 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 and then um, when they're when I'm running out of it I'm gonna start eating porridge again a gluten free porridge so that I will get a little bit more in my tummy so I can feel a little bit better yeah um We'll see how that goes. Sometimes when I do this goodnight things, I have had my pills. And those pills that I have for my night make me totally woozy. So I'm sorry if I don't make any sense. After we got home, um, I was quite tired with the finger and with everything else. A possible UTI. Yeah. My body's quite tired. So I gamed for a while and I made some cards. I made a card. The idea was wonderful. The outcome was terrible. It's not something I can put on onto my page. It is like it looks like a nine year old made it. Uh, so that is going into the oops. <laughs> bile. Sometimes things happen. Uh, I think it was because I wasn't really, I, I didn't feel I could really invest in it. Um, yesterday I did a coloring of an image for uh, a new release that will be coming out soon. 
And today uh, I sat down to make the background and I did it with like inks and embossing paste. And embossing paste needs a couple of hours to dry. Uh, you can heat set it, but embossing paste have a tendency to bubble when you heat set it. So I, I, I really didn't want to. It's basically, um, I have found out that uh, embossing paste and texture paste is basically the same. It's nothing different uh, with them. So it's just adding texture to your project. It turned out awesome, but I've been having to wait it for it to dry, so I thought I'd make a card in between, and it didn't really turn out the way I wanted. No. So I decided to just sit down, and we've been watching some TV series while I've been stitching on my beers, and I didn't take them in here for a reason. I am so close to a color finish that it is, and and the thing is, this color finish is actually the last cross stitch on the project. Yeah, so I'm almost finished, so I'm like, I'm going to tease you a little bit, because I don't want to show you until I'm finished. Yeah. Hoping to finish it, like, tomorrow. Well, at least the cross stitches tomorrow, and hopefully some of the back stitching too. And we'll see. We'll see if, if and when and what and how. Yeah. Um, but I, I'll show you when it's get, getting ready. I want to show you the whole thing. That's the thing. I want to show you the, all the beers. Because right now you only see one and a half about. So yeah. But right now I'm heading to bed. It's actually pretty late. But I'm not going to work. I'm going to have a full day at the doctor's tomorrow. Um, kind of find out if I can put, pick up some tips and tricks on the way doing stuff um so and yeah i'm I, i'm getting the results back from my vitamins and stuff tomorrow uh, on monday so that is also awesome so yeah tomorrow so that's tomorrow and i'm gonna head to bed so good night sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite bye